Hey, this is Paulo from the MB Academy, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make some type of dark, melodic leads like visages in the track Yalda. I'm sorry if I messed up the spelling right there, but I think that's how you pronounce it. But anyway, this is the sound. <laughs> But before you get started with the video, make sure you get subscribed to the channel, hit the notification bell to not miss any for future videos. And if you wanna get access to the preset and the project files, you can become a member of Preset Pass. The link is in the description below. With that being said, let's get into the video. Okay, so here you have an initial dispatch. But first, just let me show you the notes. So here we have a D sharp, F sharp, F, and G sharp. So we kinda have a diminished chord with this note. And we have a passing note, which will be this F3. So the ARP is like this. Now let's go back into Serum. Okay, so here in Serum, it's gonna be very simple. We're just gonna add a lot of unison, bring the detune down, and then run everything through a filter. Map another fold into the cutoff of the filter. Now, to change this modulation from both ways to one way, we're gonna hold Shift and Alt, then click on the knob, and we're gonna bring the cutoff down, and that's half of the sound right there. Let's just keep fine-tuning this. Let's remove the resonance here, and let's set this on envelope mode, and let's create a more creative shape. Just like that. Now let's go into the effects and we're gonna add the hyper to add some width, chorus, same thing. Then we're gonna filter all of this once again with an MG low pass, but we're gonna use a steeper version, which will be the 24 decibels per octave reduction. So hold shift and alt, bring the cutoff down. There you go. Now let's add reverb after this. Turn on the delay. We can add eight notes. And maybe some feedback. Then we can add gain with a compressor and boost the highs with an EQ. There you go, and now for post-processing, I'm just gonna add one more reverb. And so if we play this, our final result will sound like this. Okay, so that's gonna be it for the sound and also for this video. If you liked it, make sure you get subscribed to the channel, hit the notification bell to not miss any of your future videos. And if you wanna get access to the preset and the project files, you can become a member of Preset Pass. The link is in the description below. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you have a nice day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.